let their secret out. The remote. Hey, Simka, the button got stuck on the remote. How can we get it back out of there? Look and learn, Nolik. Please help. Oh, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh, oh, oh. Should I let it go? No. Oops. <laughs> no, like, hide somewhere. <laughs> She stole the remote. Nolik? Where are you hiding? Nolik? Hello there, Fixies. Hey, where are you? Hey, Tom Thomas. You got here just in time. Chusaka ran off with the TV remote. And so what? I can turn it on without it. And my favorite cartoon is just about to start. Forget about the cartoons, will ya? Nolik is missing! I'm afraid Nolik hid inside of the remote. And Chusaka took it. Oh, no, no, it's in big-time trouble. Tom Thomas, there must be something you can do! Chusaka, Chusaka, come here. Where is that dog hiding? I'm gonna go look in the other rooms. Simka, Tom Thomas, here I am. I'm over here. <sighs> For now, I'll wait here. Chusaka's not out there. Where are you? Hey, Simka. I ran to get a pack of mat What are you gonna do with it? I'm gonna search for the infrared ray that comes out of the remote. That's so great. But what is it? I'll explain it to you. Inside of most remote controls, there's a special type of light bulb called a light emitting diode, or LED for short. When we press a button, the LED sends an invisible infrared ray. And in the TV, there is a receiver for these invisible rays. The TV understands the command that comes from the remote control and carries it out, like changing the channel or the volume. If the rays are invisible, then how is it possible to see them? In the pack mat I've got these special goggles that can help me. And now what? Yell to Nolik. Get him to close the contact on any one of the buttons. Nolik! You gotta push one of the buttons down on the remote. A button? But how am I gonna do that? Wait, one second. Chusaka Chusaka with a brain full of rush. Nothing for you here. But here's something. There he is. He's over there. Chusaka, come here. Do you want a hot dog? So you want to play tough? All right, then. out for the remote's rays. It's just a shame it's impossible for me to see them. What are you saying? You can! If you want to see infrared rays, all you have to do is look through a digital camera. Try it for yourself. Turn on the camera on a mobile telephone. Now go ahead and press any button on the remote control and point the camera toward the front of it. You'll see a bright dot on the screen of the camera. That's the light emitting diode working. It's letting off a special light that can't be seen by the naked eye. It's also possible to point the remote control at a mirror. And then through the camera, you can see how the light emitting diode turns itself on. So what that means is that invisible rays bounce off of a mirror in the same way that regular light does. So you can control the TV by bouncing the light from a remote control off of a mirror. You don't believe me? Then go ahead and try it yourself. By the way, if your 
toys weren't all stuffed under the bed, we would have found the remote without the goggles. Don't worry about it. When the cartoons are over, I'll put them away. So, you done watching? Time to clean up. <laughs> <laughs>